Hello everyone, Luna Tuna checking in. Today, I am going to be drawing with you guys. Um, I posted a couple speed paints where I just draw it all out, but today I'm going to be talking and we're going to draw together. Now, I've been thinking on what we would draw and I decided that we're going to create our own warrior cat character. If you guys don't know warrior cats, then their website will be down in the description below. I highly recommend Warrior Cats. It's it's called Warriors. It's a book series and it's amazing. It's really fun. There's lots of fans out there, lots of fan art. Um, I highly recommend checking it out. But today, I'm going to draw a character. And while we're drawing them, we're going to discover their personality, what rank they are, and their clan. Um, and yeah. Let's get on to it. So for starters, um, I'm gonna try drawing it in a couple different poses. So, drawing cats. Let's draw them first sitting down. So what you do, take a light pencil just for sketching. Um, right now I'm working with a HB, but I recommend 2H. I just don't have the 2H pencil right now because I lost it. <laughs> Good on me. Anywho, let's start. So first, I'm just gonna draw a circle for the head and the lines. And mine look, may look a bit darker because of the pencil. But, um, yeah, still draw lightly. Then we're going to draw the body. So first what I do is draw them almost like 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 triangles or little pillars. Looks weird, but it's good. Um Okay. Then let's draw the ears. Just make hmm little triangles. So let's make this character like up ears. And you can make them short. Make them folded however you want. I love big long ears. My favorite. Okay, there's that step down. And now let's draw the tail. So we'll do it just kind of like this and then go around. Make it kind of to make it kind of straight because it's the ground. Fix that when we go in dark. And then go up. I'm like that. Well, you know what? We'll make this character have a fluffy tail. So, they go like that. And then, we'll just go here and make it nice and fluffy. And, at the fur. There we go. Yes. Nice and fluffy tail. Do the little inner parts there, and then it'll go up there where that is. May seem a little weird looking right now, and but it will, it will be better. It's a bit big for how I'm drawing it, but need a big scale to get all the detail. But you can do it smaller, bigger, however you want, honestly. And then now we'll start to sketch out a little bit more in detail. So. Let's start out by drawing the face. So we're just gonna kinda come in. Just do that. So before we go into doing more body type of the detail, we're going to lightly erase the sketch so it can be lighter and we can do the detail better without getting confused. So let me just go get my eraser. Okay, so I have gotten an eraser and I erased um, everything, but not too much. You have to erase it to where it's very light, but you can still see the sketch. So, let's go on with the detail and do the facial structure. But still, go in lightly in case you make a mistake, so you can erase it. Okay. Kind of like... Like that, yeah, that looks good. Okay, now since it's a fluffy cat, 
Let's do the cheek fur. Make it kind of like big. There, and now we do the other side. Kind of like so. Okay. Looks good. And now we do hmm, deciding if we should do the ears or the face. Now let's go in with the, the ears. Okay. First, do kind of like the little bit of ear fluff. And then go in and then do this. Okay. Yeah, so you just reach up to the top like this and do a big oval circle. Lots like this. And you can make the ears in like this or out. Mm. Mm, let's make them more in. So what you do for that is erase this and then go out again and make them more like this. Out. More like this. And then Do that. Mm -hmm. And here's a bit longer. Fix that. My ears don't always have to be even. You, ne you never make something like look the exact same unless you're doing like digital art and you can copy and paste. But when you're doing just the original, like classic or hand, uh, however you want to call it, you just Go for it. Just go for it. Mm -hmm. Now, just do a little head like this. And we'll decide if we want to give them hair or not. And now we'll go in with the, the face. And we'll do kind of like that. Kind of like so. Hmm, it looks like Spider-Man. <laughs> Didn't change much, but there we go. Now we'll do the nose. Oh, cat nose. And do this. Yeah. Just put that in the center button. look too good so we'll just erase that you can add it if you want to but I'm just going to erase it put that back in nose There. Now, let's just pull up this chin a little bit. Okay. Looks good so far. Now, we go in. So, you can either, either give them a neck or you could just do fluff. But for now, I think I'm just going to go for a challenge. So, just do those shoulders, and now we're going to go in, like this. Okay, let's make those a little bit round, more round. Mm -hmm. Alright, so there's that. 
And then we side. So the chest, we're going like this. No, no, no. We're sitting down, so it's to go in more. Like. Hmm. Okay, so we'll just make like that. Okay, and then we'll raise all this. This is a new little way of drawing the body for me, so it's a challenge. But it looks good so far. Now we'll just erase this. And go in a little more. Like that. Fix this. To make it wear. And like this. There we go. Okay. Now let's do the back part of the body. So one cap like this. And okay, so Okay, so it kind of feels like like that, yeah. Yeah, that's how they kind of sit. Oh no. So yeah, this is kind of like from a sideways view. A little bit. Like, not super sideways. Just a little bit. So we're gonna make... And then like that. Just like that. There we go. That looks good so far. Now... We'll do the tail. So it goes like this from from right about there. Yeah, just like that. And then I'll go like this. This cat has a long tail. Let's make it a bit shorter. I love long tails. But okay, so just sketch it out. To be okay. So now let's add the fluff. Lace it lightly. Now go in. So go like this, and then have fluff right there. And I'll turn. Go down. And then the fluffs a bit. Washed. So, we're doing that. Nice. And then when it comes up, it kind of poops out. And then, it goes in like that. There we go. Okay, I'm gonna make this like. It's cute. Let's fix this. Fix this. The ground isn't crooked. There. Let's erase the line here. And like so. And there we go. Now you have the full detailed sketch of your cat. So let's just add some little eyes. Yeah, that's cute. And let's let's make this cat a girl. Why not? Give her some little lashes. And like 
like that. Oh my gosh, my dog is barking. Okay, and there is the first detailed sketch of your cat. Okay, so your cat should look a bit like this. And you see here, I added a little bit of fluffs on the shoulders, a little bit on the backside, and fixed the tail a teensy bit. Then I added also whiskers. So now I'm just going to go over it in darker pencil and I'll be back with you guys shortly. Okay, so now we are going to draw another position. We're going to draw her running. Now, this will be a challenge for me because I don't usually draw animals or cats running, but I'm going to try it out. And if it looks bad, then I'll just cut this part out of the video. But <laughs> Okay, so first we're going to sketch it out. And what we do, I think, we're going to... do this. So we're just going to draw like a circle that's almost like bent. A bent oval. Almost looks like a cat nose upside down. And then go into so yeah it's like an upside down cat nose close up. Like that. And then let's draw the legs. So it'll be one circle here. Draw the back legs. One circle like this. And then like this. Then we're going to do the front ones. Like this. Like this. And like this. And then like almost. Hmm. Let's do this a bit more like that. Mm -hmm. Kind of like <laughs> hmm. Just going to draw it like this. Like that. Okay, so I'm like, Ooh. yeah, almost on to that. Looks very weird right now, but it will get better. And we do this, and like that, and the other one. this and the paw will be like kind of on the ground halfway on the ground so <laughs> that looks so weird oh my gosh okay just do a circle like that all about the circles, people. Okay, and then we'll do her tail. Goes like this. Now we'll cut into your other drawing a little bit, but that's okay. Kind of links them all together. Mm. Okay. 
There. And now for the heart pit. The head. Well, it wasn't too hard, but like. Okay. And then we'll do the mouth. Like that. And then the ears. Which we do just like that, and then the other one like that. Okay, so that's our cat running so far. And then we go into detail. So I'm just gonna do that really quick. Okay, so I finished making, sketching out like the detail of the sketch. I changed it a bit. So instead of making the, the back like that, you make it go up and around like that. I figured that out when trying to sketch it because when I did the detail with the original thing, it did not look nice. And then with here, just go like, mm, like that, kind of. I don't know if that makes sense, but you know, here's just a, so if you want to like have try to do one running, like just like this with this body type, you can copy or whatever. But of course, do your own thing. And now I'm going to do the darkened outline in the speed paint. Thing. No, it's not called speed paint. Whatever, you know what I mean. See you then. <laughs> So here is the final like little sketch of our ideas. Put them together. So in the end, you know, first off, start all beautiful like this, you know, with like no hair and stuff. And then I made her more like this with a little bit of hair. And mm, kind of kept her cheeks the same. Yeah, she looks cute. And then finally we have our final sketch. Her tail is a bit more like fluffy, but it's still the longness. She has more fluff around here, and then she has a little bit more hair. And hmm. yeah, I think looks really good. So this is our little character, and I'm going to end it there for the video. And in the next video, we'll draw a final big sketch of her. Like in one position and color it at all and decide what her color is going to be and if she'll have any special patterns. So thank you all so much for watching. I'll see you all next time. <laughs> I hope you all enjoyed this video. Thank you so much all for watching. If you have made it this far into the video, there's a little surprise thing at the end and you will see it. But before you do, I just want to say Make sure, if you like this video, to leave a like and leave a comment down below on what you think her color should be, her name, and what her, and her patterns should be, or if she has any little, um, any little, like, souvenir or little thing that makes her her. And please leave what you think her whole personality should be. Or any ideas for a personality and don't forget to subscribe and hit that little notification button please to join our little fishy pond and yeah i will see you all next time bye bye coming soon to this channel a little meme Behind the scenes, the last hope. Fine.
finding a stupid dark pencil. Oh my god! Mm. 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 Let's do the cheek fur. And do kind of. Mm. Now I have to cut this out. Now I have to cut this out and do it again.